Hello everyone, Amador here, and welcome back to Am's Journeys. Uh, we are having some lag, apparently. I am currently in my cave base, and um, I have a zombie spawner over here. And it does pretty good. Um, but I kind of want to dress it up and make it a little bit more useful. <laughs> Now to do that, one of the first things I need to do is get in here and shut it down. There we go. So that it's um, not going to kill us. Let's go ahead and pick up these trap doors. And um, what I want to do is... I want to clean this out and kind of make it a, make a nice space out of it. So first things first, let me um, dig this out here. And once I get that done, I shall be back. So I have the area cleared out. Um, I have I've, I've gone two blocks out beyond what the original floor was. Um, I do need some wood. Uh, some, some spruce logs would be nice, or some oak logs. I think oak logs, since that seems to be what I've got going on in here. So let me find my oak over here in my little storage room. Hmm. Alright. So don't have any oak logs, so let me go find that, and I'll be right back. So I was going out to go get some oak, and I happened to notice these guys. Um, I think they're moving towards me? I'm not really sure. But I'm not really in any situation where I can fight those guys, so... I'm going to get away as far as I can for the moment. Uh, <laughs> yes, yeah, I'm not ready for those. Okay, so we are back. We've got some supplies. I'm going to start by putting some oak logs in the corners. Um, okay. And right here. Okay, so that is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five. <clears throat> four. There we go. Two, three, four, five. Okay. So there is that. Uh, then we're going to need to pull this out of here. We'll probably want to break up some of this. So we can have some of the mossy cobble. Elsewhere. There we go. Now we're probably going to put some of, or I mean, we're going to put some back into the floor once we get uh, get things situated. But uh, first. I want to pull it out, and um, I'm just going to change it over to cobble, so we um, kind of know what we're working with here. Whoops. So we're going to fill in this floor here. We're also going to fill in in between the pillars with cobble. Let me 
do have a little bit of smooth stone, or I have stone anyway, in here, and we can cook up some more. Let's get cobble down first. And I'm just wanting to dress this thing up so it looks a little bit nicer. Um, mechanics wise, I'm going to keep it pretty much as I had it with those trap doors, um, blocking any real entrance or exit to it. Um, I may have enough materials to make a couple of hoppers. Let me see if I've got some iron over here. Um, okay, so I do have iron, um, which could be useful. Uh, let's see. A double chest for our loot. And let's make two chests for hoppers. Um, we can stick this potato in there. There we go. We got a couple of hoppers. Put our iron back in there. And we've gotten a little bit of resources. We've gotten some iron uh, to use. So we're not as primitive as we were. Um, let's see. Let's plan out. Okay, so we're going to put them there. We want a two or a one. I think a one. Just have a one a one space thing in here for the zombies to come and attack me. Um, I'll need to move this stuff so that I can get in there because I'm going to put walls basically out here. Okay. So that's going to be where the walls are at. Okay, so we have the room here that we're going to have the zombies spawn in uh, situated. I've got uh, three hoppers here that feed into this chest. Um, so what I'll do is I'll end up putting a, a couple of trap doors here um, so that uh, zombies can't get through to me. I might need to make this a little wider. I don't know if this, if only one wide is going to work here or not. We're, we'll find out. Um, but we are first thing we all, I want to do is I want to um, put in some some other blocks and just kind of dress this up a bit. Okay, so I've got some stone, I've got some mossy cobble. I got a little bit of gravel that we can put in here. that I think that works pretty good and I will do this one that stone I'll put in a couple of pieces of mossy cobble in here 
and a little bit of gravel. There we go. Yeah, just like that. I think that's uh, is looking pretty good. Let's break this up here. Um, mossy cobble will work, and we'll do the same thing here. Boom, 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 and then some stone. And let's go ahead and mix in a little bit of gravel. There we go. Now this zombie farm, this, this XP farm, isn't going to be like super efficient. Um, and it's not going to be automatic or anything because it's it's going to require me to, to actually kill stuff um, which is perfectly fine there we go just like that And I kind of want to do the same thing with the floor. Just like that. Okay, so there are the walls. We got these over here. Um, there we go. And a piece of gravel. We don't have a whole lot of space there. So floor. Let's get stone in here first. Perfect. Absolutely. Okay. Really cool. All right. So we can put a little bit of gravel in here. because I just killed that one. Okay. So there is gravel, some stone, and some cobblestone. And, you know, I think I'm going to not put down any mossy on the floor. I think I'm going to just leave it like that. Alright, so the next thing I want to do um, is I need to put in... So I have my trapdoors here, okay. 
let's whoops not do that let's get rid of these now comes the quick and dangerous part We've gotta be on the ball here as soon as I start taking these away it's gonna want to spawn stuff which it just did and I died and they're going to take my stuff. Um, oh, yeah. I'm back in town. Uh, let me get back to the cave. And I shall be right back. Alright. We got our stuff. Some of our stuff. Zombies did take some of it. Um, let's see if we can get it back. Yeah, see, he's got our gear. Yeah, right. We've got our gear back. Okay, so we need to get these trap doors in here. There we go. So the zombies should see us and want to come to us. And we should be able to just do this and kill them. If we need to, we can open up the trap doors and pop in there and grab stuff. Now, we don't see a lot of our handiwork in there, but um, it's there. And we're getting uh, stuff. I think that iron shovel is mine. Ooh, he's got gold pants. Drop the gold pants. Nope. Ooh. Oh, I hadn't even thought about that. Let's go ahead and strip those. Um. <laughs> Works fine. And I like it. Now we do have this space over here that we wanted to leave open so that we can do something with this later on. Um, I think I am going to put a grinding wheel over here. Um, I think I need a stone slab. Yep. There we go, grinding wheel. Having a grinding wheel nearby. Um, you know, let's make a second one of those. Just for funsies. There we go. And we get some levels out of it too. Which is good. Uh, I want to fix this. I meant to put that down like that. There we go. We got an axe here. Hmm. We 
might want to consider doing this. So it seems like that carpet there is causing some difficulties. Um, because the XP is not wanting to come off of there. Um, so we may need to figure out something to do with that. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and put that back in there for now. <laughs> But we got ourselves a nice little starter XP farm here, and I think everything's going to work out pretty good. Um, let's not get ourselves stuck in here. Alright. Um, now, before I end this episode, I think I want to run over to the shopping district and see if anybody's built anything. So uh, let me head over there and I shall be right back. All right, so here is the shopping district. It looks like somebody has started to put together a spruce farm or a, or a spruce. We've got a uh, couple of lamps here. We've got a uh, bread and stuff shop. One loaf equals one iron. Two loaf equals two iron. Um, that doesn't seem like much of a deal. But, uh, hmm. <laughs> um, let's get rid of that. Let's go ahead and buy some bread. What is this? Carrots. Carrots. Oh, somebody's gotten some heads. One iron or gold ingot for four carrots. Ew. Nice. Somebody's got themselves a little carrot farm going. Nice little waterfall there. Looks pretty good. I, I like the, uh, the sh uh, roofs with the, um, gray or the leaves on top. It seems to be, uh, Pretty cool, and we got some uh, fish heads here. Somebody's uh, been doing some of that, and we got some armor stands in here. All right, so one iron, not fifty-seven iron, just one, and we'll do that. All right, do a little shopping. What is in through here? Oh, okay. And it is getting night, so we probably should um, think about sleeping. It sounds like some skellies are around here. Oh, somebody's got some dark oak saplings here. These aren't going to grow because you need to have them like put together in fours. Because dark oak only grows when it's grouped in fours like this. There we go. So, uh, that is about all the time I have for this episode. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit the like button down below. If you'd like to see more, hit the subscribe button. And until next time, you guys have a good one. Goodbye.